the last, uh, they're trying to take the last piece. It's the last piece of the puzzle for them. They have Hollywood, they have the mainstream media, they have uh, countless cultural institutions. They have the House, they have the Senate, the presidency was it, and now they're pushing it uh, in our faces. And I want the, the, this group to know that they have to fight back. Because 40 years ago, this happened in Hollywood, and the conservatives and the non-leftists acquiesced, and they, act, they were a, a combinationist. And 40 years later, those people don't have a voice in Hollywood. Any more George Mason hecklers? CPAC? What are George? What, what, Remember that kid, the guy that came up and heckled you at CPAC? The iPhone, he called you racist. I, I've been called racist. I was being interviewed by Terry Moran uh, of, of ABC, ABC uh, right in front of the White House, and I was just called racist. That's the power of the media. Had they not bought the false line from the Congressional Black Caucus as instigated by uh, Nancy Pelosi trying to change the subject from the unpopularity of the health care bill, they concocted a strategy and they knew that the mainstream media would go along with it and make it so that the Tea Party would have to answer to uh, the worst accusation in modern America, and that is that you're a racist. It's BS. Just like Madonna Constantine uh, at Columbia University who said that a noose was done in, in her, her office, just like the Duke Lacrosse thing.